today we are at Rajmachi and doing kind of a camping and a trekking trip. So we will be camping here today uh, at one of the places over here. We have brought our own tents and then tomorrow morning we would be trekking Rajmachi uh, early in the morning. The last 13 kilometers of the road was a very bumpy ride uh, but a good scenic one. So yeah, so that's keep in mind if you are coming by your own vehicles till Rajmachi. Uh, the last 13 kilometers is a little bad, but uh, it's quite scenic. Good driving skills. <laughs> and you require some good driving skills as well. So yeah, let's see how the day progresses and we go about things. A 10 minute walk from the village of Rajmachi will bring you to the Udaisagar lake. Uh, it's a small little lake uh, as you can see in the background uh, and a temple over there. So you can come and visit this small place before going on your hike to Rajmachi. It's a quite beautiful place. The temple is quite old. Uh, I'll just show you as soon as I reach over there. So good morning guys, it's around 6.25 in the morning and we have started our hike towards Shri Vardhan Fort which is a part of Rajmachi So first we would be trekking towards Shri Vardhan and then towards Maneranjan uh, It's a beautiful morning out here I don't know whether the GoPro is giving any justice uh, but the sun is just rising from the east and has lit up the entire area.
Hi guys, so we are on top of Manaranjan, uh, one of the two Balikillas of Rajmachi. Uh, we did today both Shivardhan and uh, Manaranjan. Yesterday we came here and we camped uh, and had a look at some of the places near the village like the Udewadi Lake etc. So overall today's trek was a very good trek, quite a bit of fortification still left on both the Balikillas. Uh, both are having vast areas to explore. Hope you like this entire video I put through. Do like, share, comment and subscribe. See you until the next track.